Alright, so last night I had like a bad reaction, I believe, to this tapioca flour. I cooked it, it turned it turns to like a jelly when you cook it. And I, I also had my my sour cream. But I don't think the sour cream is catching up with me. I, I just tried this tapioca and it gave me and I got an instant reaction. If you read on the internet, it says you can, it has uh, latex. I think I got a latex poisoning. I've got, I know I'm allergic to latex from the gloves that'll make my, the skin on my hands bubble up. But I think it might have affected my, my heart too. I think it just, I think it targets my heart, this tapioca, in a negative way. And I gave it a try because the Perfect Health Diet book said that I should do the tapioca, but I had my doubts. I, th I thought I'd recall having problems before in the past. So I cooked something else here. You can see it's kind of dry. It's kind of dry. It's chicken, all barley. This is all, yeah, that's good. It's well cooked. I threw these tomatoes on top. They're dehydrated. They're kind of got rehydrated. This barley actually is kind of plain. I think I might want to put some salt. I was hoping uh, the chicken grease would get in there more. Not not as much as I care for. It just needs like salt, which I actually have. Oh, there it is. Yeah. Oh no, that's curry. Maybe a little curry too. Uh, curry and salt. The salt rub. Oh yeah, and then obviously the the sour cream will make it taste really good. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Sour cream covers everything. All my bases is. I was not happy about that, the heart issue though, that really was something, okay, it's like, I kind of knew some, there would be a problem, and now I'm documenting it, I'm not going to have tapioca ever again, okay, that's, that was rough, it woke me up at night, and I was just up, and and when I tried to relax at times, I like, I had my heart feel like it was just going to give out. A lot of these problems go right to my heart, okay? Maybe other organs are the, are the, the main focus or something are really struggling, but it, they ultimately make my heart go, okay? They make my heart struggle. And heart, heart attacks are one of the most common ways to die, so... Um, any, any problems, they just, they seem to, like, just fall back on the heart. Okay. And latex, the, uh, what is it, uh, it's, it's a, it's a allergy, an allergic reaction. So, I had an allergic reaction to the latex, and that's, that caused my heart to really struggle. I feel okay now. I feel better. Weather's good. It's not. It hasn't been raining in a while. I, I do feel a little of the aftermath from last night. Just not, it's just a lack, a slight lack of sleep. Okay, but overall I feel okay. So I'm just gonna just carry on. I I, I can eat curry. The curry is not bad, of course. I, there's a lot of roots I can eat. I can eat dandelion roots. I can eat all kinds of roots. Not so much stinging nettle root, though. That hurts my stomach. And it's said to hurt my stomach. It's just it's just interesting. You know, there's... Not every root is good. Kava, kava? That's terrible. All right, it gets you, like, high and relaxed, but it tears up your liver. I've, I've felt pain in, directly in my liver from after having some kava, kava. There's some roots that... Will will be good for you, and like val valerian, valerian maybe not so much. It'll relax you, but it's hard on the liver. And there's some roots that are just terrible, like this this tapioca or cassava root. You just you got to take it in small quantities and 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 see how it how you react to it. Um, and I just I gave it another try. Just make, make a note now that 
if, if for anybody really, it's, unless you're Southeast Asian, which they seem to be, um, they seem to have uh, like immunity to it. 